Hi everybody, look, we got some carnitas, we got some pork right here, some onions, oil, powder, garlic, salt, and pepper. And um, we put some oil and we'll cut up our, our chunks of uh, pork in the smaller pieces. We season it with salt, pepper, and salt, uh, powder, garlic, okay? Uh, with that, at a medium heat and we go ahead and add half an onion if you have an orange add the orange juice and the actual orange itself i didn't have any but it does give it a good flavor and in the meantime we're gonna leave the the the, the meat the pork for about two hours in a low heat just keep checking it make sure it doesn't you know burn we're gonna make some chile de arbol we put that to boil in the water dig to hydrate the chiles basically that's what we're doing and on this uh we're sauteing some onion and tomato we're cutting up some onion and cilantro this is to garnish our tacos and uh, we're going to go ahead and make our salsa we're going to go and blend it up we add about a cup of water our uh, ingredients of course you add your salt and powdered garlic and uh, you blend it up based on the consistency you're looking for i want something creamy um and the water as well, I just added a cup of water. It depends how you want it, but this is basically what I'm looking for. See, and it's this is what we got. Doesn't that look delicious? Ready for some tacos, right? So we're going to check our pork. See, it's halfway done. Just keep checking on it. If you feel that it's, you know, drying up, you add a little bit of water and then it's done. Now we're going to go ahead and cut this up and we're going to uh, make some assemble some tacos we have some tortillas i like my corn tortillas i buy them at Nordic market because it says yellow corn and they are delicious they taste like homemade tortillas look at the color so we have our canitas we're gonna head and garnish it with our onion and cilantro and our chile de arbol a creamy chile de arbol and here we are we have four tacos any other recipes any questions comments anything else that you want i'm open for any ideas but basically like i said don't forget if you have orange i would cut them up in slices squeeze out the the juice from that and it will taste delicious so hopefully i'll see you in the next uh recipe